communion. All right, let me ask children. What is, children, what is a manger? Who knows what a manger is? What's a manger, Elsie? An angel bed. Okay, so it's a manger is where baby Jesus was born or laid. But what else is a manger apart from the place where the baby Jesus was laid, yes? A basket. It could be a basket, thank you. Yes, what were you going to say? A crib, okay, very good. William? It's where animals are fed from. Okay, it's where animals are fed from. Okay, that's the big thing here. Oh, can someone do the next slide? Okay, so there is a picture of a manger. Is it what you expected? Not really, it's not like the, main, the pictures you see at Christmas, right? That's a manger. That's probably, that's from the first century, that's from, the, from Israel. That's probably the sort of thing Jesus was laid in. Next picture, whoever's got them there. That's a modern day manger. So Jesus was born today and put in a manger. That's what he'd be put in. That's a photograph I took of all of the country park oh. with some sheep feeding there. Can you imagine laying mothers? Can you imagine laying your baby in this? Where all the animals have been eating? Slobbering around. Not very nice. Next picture. Baby Jesus. In a very clean looking manger. With very clean looking straw. It may not have been quite as clean and neat and tidy <coughs> as that, right? The word manger is an animal feeding trough in a stable. And they were usually stone. Like the one we saw earlier. Of course manger is a French word. For what, you Eat. French speakers? Eat. Manger. Manger. Right? It's where the <coughs> animals manger. It's where they ate in a translation into transliteration into, into English. In other words, it was dirty and disgusting. Jesus wasn't born into a comfortable life, into a comfortable world. He was born and laid in something that was just, just dirty and disgusting where animals ate. That's the world Jesus came in. And he came in willing. He came in willing. He came here for us. He wasn't too proud to be associated with animals. And he's not too proud to be associated with people like us, who often, let's face it, are a bit dirty and disgusting. And not just physically. And we have our faults, we have our problems, we have our sins. He was he laid in a manger in some ways that's very helpful for thinking about the communion because now we feed on him. We feed on him who was laid in a place where animals were. And that's what the communion is about. Taking bread and wine to remind ourselves that we feed on his bread, on his body and his blood shed and broken for us. <coughs> as it says in John 6, Just as the living Father sees me, and I live because of the Father, so the one who feeds on me will live because of me. This is the bread that came down from heaven. Your ancestors ate manna and died. But whoever feeds on this bread will live forever. Let's pray and then we will feed on this bread. Right, so, we're going to have a little play. This might not be your usual kind of nativity play. I hope not. If you know me, it's not going to be a normal play. So, some of you have been given roles to do. No, this is not a drill. And no, I'm not an angel. I'm far from it. Oh, come on. Angel So, we're going to have some innkeepers. We're going to have some angels. We'll have two lovely narrators that's going to read the story for us. When they read your character, the narrator, we'll have Becky here, and we'll have Jude here. When the narrator read your name, pop up and come and do your thing here on stage. We'll have an amazing donkey, which is uh, flown in from a distant land. We'll have a lovely baby Jesus at the end. Beautiful baby Jesus. And uh, so... Uh, and Bill, last minute request, when Joseph come to the innkeepers and pretend to knock, can you do your beatbox? Yeah.
Thank you very much. And uh, so, uh, narrators, please take your positions. And uh, everyone, make sure you listen to what the narrators say. Let's do it. Many years ago, there was a young lady called Mary. From the Bible, I mean, not the baker off the telly. This one day, or maybe even night, an angel appeared suddenly and gave Mary quite a fright. The angel said, Don't worry, Mary. You are going to have a very special baby who has to be called Jesus. <laughs> Joseph had to travel to Bethlehem. It was a long, hard journey, and Mary rode on a donkey while Joseph was beside her. Donkey, you're bad breath. This isn't Uber. <laughs> By the time they reached Bethlehem, Mary and Joseph were very tired. They need to find a place, place to sleep, but the town was so full of people, and everywhere they went, they were told that there was no room for them. Mary and Joseph were. And then he remembered he had a stable where he kept his animals. It would be warm and dry. He said they could sleep there. Oh. Joseph made a bed of hay for Mary. All the animals <coughs> came to watch over Mary. It seems that every creature wants to see what's happening in this special place. That night, baby Jesus was born. He slept in a manger where hay had been put for the animals. Baby Jesus on the way. Baby Jesus on the way. <laughs> 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 
<coughs> now, in a field nearby, there were some shepherds. They were minding their own business, <laughs> maybe cleaning their shoes. Socks! Maybe trying to scrape off all the smelly sheep poos. <laughs> but all of a sudden, something really weird happened. Out of nowhere, an angel appeared. Don't be scared, we have great news. Jesus has been born. Thank you, Angel. Beautiful. Don't be afraid. Jesus has been born. You will find him in a stable in Bethlehem. The shepherds were very happy at the good news <laughs> and went to Bethlehem to find a stable. When they got there, they saw the baby Jesus lying in the manger. <laughs> there were also some wise men in the story. They had been travelling a very long way, but they didn't use the Google Maps or the They followed the star. And they bought him some gold, frankincense, and myrrh. And the wise men fell down and worshipped him. All <laughs> 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 the people in the stable knew that a very special baby had been born. They all watched very quietly as the baby Jesus slept in the manger. The end. Yeah. <laughs>